Playing Crash Friday in Cobb County. Good Sunday evening to you. I'm Deidre Dukes. Authorities released his name today. 78 year old Robert Westlake of Atlanta. Fox 5's Nathalie Pozo is live at Charlie Brown Airport in Fulton County, where the plane was based out of. And Nathalie, you spoke with the family members today. Well, Deidre, as we can all imagine, the family is going through a very difficult time. Now, they were kind enough to spend a few moments talking to me over the phone about Robert Westlake earlier today, describing him as a great man who will be dearly missed. A great father, great grandfather, great pilot, and he is dearly missed. That's the statement from 78 year old Robert Westlake's family. Westlake died Friday when his 1976 Cessna Citation 500 jet crashed in the front yard of this Marietta home on Vista Wood Lane. The homeowners were at church when the plane came down and are keeping the pilot and his family in their prayers. What you need to do is pray for the pilot and his family. This is replaceable. Westlake's family tells me he was on a business trip. Authorities say the pilot was returning from Cincinnati when he radioed that he was having mechanical troubles. Within moments, the plane crashed. Debris scattered the neighborhood. It's very eerie to be holding what possibly that the, the pilot had. Federal investigators recovered the recorder from the cockpit. The wreckage removed from the site as the FAA and NTSB conclude their on-site investigation. Authorities say it's a miracle. No one else was hurt. Where some of these airplanes crash next to schools and residential areas and uh, thankfully nobody else is injured. And the cause of the crash is still under investigation. Reporting live tonight in Fulton County, Nathalie Pozo, Fox 5 News.